walking outside and have four or five roosters just trailing right behind me. I mean, we used to have a rooster as a kid that would follow us, and it wasn't fun. If he caught you, he would take his spurs and, and you know, scratch up your heels. And he did that to me a couple times. I used to have to go let him out, but I was so scared of him that I used to sneak up so he wouldn't hear me coming, you know, unlock the door from the outside, push it open, and take off running. And he'd chase out after me every night. We had this game, you know, and I would run across the driveway as fast as my bare little feet could fly, you know, across the gravel. And I knew if I made it to the other side of the driveway, he would he would stop. He was territorial, but if you stayed on that side of the driveway, he would, like, just strut over there, and he was fine. I knew enough not to stick around. I didn't, you know, it never crossed my mind to make a stand, you know. Well, one night, me and my dad were at home, and we came home, and my oldest sister was a redhead. She was sitting there plucking that rooster. So what happened was she had to go let the chickens out. She didn't know or care about the rooster. She was barefoot as well. This rooster charges at her. Well, she just kicked him. But I guess her bare feet were enough. And anyway, that night we had chicken chicken dinner, and it was really good. It was one of uh, my happiest memories of that mean rooster was that dinner we had that night. So good times, good times. Thanks for the memory. By the way, if you don't know who this was, that was Possum the Appalachian. Go give her a follow. She's one of my favorite TikTok creators. She's just one of the most genuine, down-to-earth people on this app. God bless you.